Snow? Of course, but wear your warm clothes. <laughs> is a snowflake water droplets frozen around aerosols what it takes I am a snowflake humidity and temperature are why I take different shape water vapor in the air rises to the atmosphere where it meets up with particles they are called dust or aerosols water vapor starts to cling to these small microscopic things which then form water droplets and they are microscopic and when the air begins to freeze and ice crystal forms out of these which is the birth of a snowflake next i'll tell you how they take shape what is a snowflake water droplets frozen around aerosols what it takes I am a snowflake, humidity and temperature are why I take different shape. When ice crystals start to grow, vapor deposition makes snow, which means within sub-freezing air, ice points from the water vapor there. This new formed ice starts to grow on the ice crystal, now you know in this freezing environment these crystals form in abundance. When they reach a certain weight, they fall to earth at such a rate, humidity and temperature form the shapes that do occur. Then the snowflake hits the ground, they appear white, yes, all around, no two snowflakes are alike, each one's unique to our sight. Usually they have six sides and cluster when they collide, so next time you touch some snow, think of what had made it grow. What is a snowflake? Water droplets frozen around aerosols, what it takes. I am a snowflake, humidity and temperature are why I take different shape. What is a snowflake? Water droplets frozen around aerosols, what it takes. I am a snowflake, humidity and temperature are why I take different shape. Ulyana! <laughs> huh? It's lunchtime! Sorry, Snowflake. I have to go now, but we'll meet again soon. Okay. Bye-bye, Snowflake! <laughs>